as expected, not a ticket left, ladies and gentlemen. We are sold out at the Grand Theater. I'm Todd Grisha. Alongside me, Johnny Nelson. You tried to give me the slip, didn't you, my friend? There was no way I was... It's Floyd Patterson. Tommy the... This bout is scheduled. We welcome you to this beautiful theater. Shakespeare has nothing. They ring the bell, and here we go. <coughs> Big swing and a miss with the hook. That just had to hurt. What a fitting stage for this grudge match. This theater has seen a lot of drama over the years, but there's none more compelling than this. You walk in, you cannot hide or jump or stand behind anybody. The audience is on you. They see every single movement, every single twist. If you're scared, the thousands of people are here in this place, they will spot it. This is a battle royale between two heavyweight bombers. Can they figure out the combination to this set? Ooh, that really affected Floyd there. And that'll do it. Patterson goes down. Referee says we will fight on. Not sure about this one. He's got to waste time. Get step behind the referee. When he comes close, tie him up. The referee's then got to paw you. Walk around the ring. You've just got to make the most of it. Because if you let him jump back on you again, he's going to get momentum. He's going to down again. And that's a lot of points to lose in the round. Total domination with 10 seconds to go. Boy, this next round is going to be crucial considering the knockdown we just witnessed. I love the response, though. Got back up, took a deep breath, and thought, right, brush it off, get on with the job. Three, come on, suck it up, suck it up. How much work have you put in the... And there's the bell to start the round. His eyes look pretty clear here, Johnny. How do you think he's going to do after being knocked down in the last round? Oh, listen to me. If I knock somebody down like that, that round, you know this round coming out? He's getting everything, everything. Full battle because I know his legs are gone. So I'm thinking, you know what's going to happen. If he doesn't, I'll be very, very surprised. A straight right just misses. A perfect counter shot. This fighter embodies the cardinal rule of boxing. Hit and don't get hit. Oh, this one is Tommy Morrison. Oh, no. What's happened? through the round and I think he knows he's got a lot of work to do. So he's up in the corner has the white towel. Are they going to throw it and stop this fight? Well, now it's about getting back to the corner pressing up, getting new instructions given to you and they've got to G you up. They've got to tell you what you're doing wrong and what you're doing right. That is a show of character. When you put down your eagles hurt, your chin's hurt, your body's hurting and you've got to get up, suck it up and think right and back in the game again. It's so, so hard for fighters. That left-handed jab doesn't quite score. Final 10 seconds here, and the corner better get warmed up. They've got some work to do. Let's talk about Morrison in that last round. So it's plan B time after being knocked down in that round. Can make or break a fighter. So much free 
three. Come on, suck it up. Suck. We're hoping for an all-action slugfest. He got knocked down in the last round. Let's see what he can do here. That knockdown we just saw was a heavy knockdown. I'd be very, very surprised if he'll come out fresh as a daisy. What's gonna happen? He's gonna do something. He's gonna bluff him. He threw a punch and just got countered. Has to be careful for that receipt. It's always coming. They both want the knockout. Nice idea with the jab, but does not land. This fighter told us yesterday, I don't get paid by the minute. And Morrison did not handle that punch well. This fighter continues to show how much heart he's got, but the corner may have to intervene here. What resilience to be down and to be back up again, to get yourself back into fight again, to show your fitness and determination, maximum respect. That jab doesn't score. <laughs> Not the best of rounds with 10 seconds to go. Let's talk about Morrison in that last round. Let's see how the game plan changes after that big knockdown. You've been put down. You've got to think right. So fire. They ring the bell and here we go. Let's see how he bounces back here after getting dropped in the last round. What a knockdown. One minute, you need one hour to get over a shot like that. Now it's down to condition. Now it's down to mental strength and preparation. It's how you are going to deal with this. That uppercut just missed. This is a high octane battle. Have to be careful for that receipt. It's always coming. How about that time counter shot? It's obvious who the bigger, stronger fighter is. Let's see if they use it to their advantage. Hard reach as well as speed. Reach as well as power. What more can a fighter ask for? We're the halfway point of this round, and both of these fighters have had their moments. The skill could go either way. Very close match. It shows the skill, the discipline, the respect both fighters have for each other, because no one dare do anything out of turn. So much for being a good sport here. They're going to taunt. Perfect counter shot. A straight right just misses. That right hook won't score. Every time he throws a punch, a receipt is coming right back. Pretty dominant round there. Let's see how they respond here in the next round. Dominance, without a doubt, made it look so, so easy. We're hoping for an all-action slugfest. After a really strong round, let's see if they can finish the job. God, my motto is, if it's not broken, why change it? An excellent last round, everything works. Wait for the reaction. Until then, keep doing what you've just been doing because you've won that hands down. 
As it is in most heavyweight fights, don't blink because one big shot and this thing could be over. Throwing the hook, but it doesn't score. Nice counter. Swing and a miss with that hook. Madison's rocked. He's back up, but the corner has to take some responsibility here and maybe stop this fight. Oh, he can smell blood. Look at that. He's putting down walls. He knows what shot works and where to land him. Then try and do it again. He's just not got to get trigger happy. These two fighters are made for one another. In the final 10 seconds here in a pretty dominant display. What a huge momentum swing that's going to be considering that round will be 10-8 after the knockdown. Can make or break a fighter. And there's the bell to start the round. He couldn't finish him off in the last round. Let's see what this has in store for us. What a heavy knockdown. How are they going to come back from that? They staggered back to the corner. They've got to crush him up. Alert them again. Get him back on point again. Oh, that got Patterson off kilter. You heard that right, ladies and gentlemen. A knockout victory and one of the biggest surprises of the year. Oh, what a shot. What a shot. You see shots like that in the gym. At least for once, this is on TV. That